<laughs> you know shit about being car sick. I, I know everything about everything there is to know, Molly. Especially about being car sick. That's one way to do it, bud. Good job, Jumpy. heat exchangers back for the den den I got a light bulb in there now the thing about these they're supposed to go straight through no disruptions it's been a big deal it took us forever to get it because of it see if it starts in there it's going all the way through and it's all square But it's supposed to be a new design, new style design. It still gets the same heat and capacity or whatever. But we're gonna give her a shot. It took forever to get this thing, but they screwed it up in the factory once. And <coughs> sent it back, wrong thing. They had to send it back up again. Get them to do it again, they said. So it's been kind of a over deal but we got her finally got high expectations for it. we'll see what it's going to do all right nick's been working on the den den i've been working on fixing on brutus and uh i noticed that my spot behind the cab air is full of sticks it's like what the hell so i got to thinking i was like man i must have lost on that last job and i got to walk around and everybody of course i go to leave everybody's like you never find out you never find out that's pretty much what they look like when they say that you never found that. Well, look what I found. <laughs> See, because around here, it's no parts left behind. 4.45 tons. Four and a half tons. Yeah, 4.45. How bad did it squat? What? Did it even really stretch its legs? It's picking the other side of the truck up. The outrigger's on the other side off the ground. You gonna do it? The other day we had a loader and his crane on there. It took a loader to get it off. What a beast. Nick said, I had my other truck. He said I'd pick it right off there and I thought he full blown him. By God, he wasn't kidding. He was not kidding. That is, that is giving her a stretch now. But it's a doing it. Nick said he tried to sell this and they didn't want to give him what he needed out of it. And he said, I kept it. And I said, I think that's probably a good decision. Yeah, that other one ain't got nothing on this one. Wow. What a piece. I've been doing my pads. Me and Nick talked about them. We're putting a hillbilly fix on it. We're taking it apart, cleaning them off. They'd been loose since we got the rig. It's pretty good divot in there. But I'm cleaning them out, getting the dirt out of it. Nick said you gotta polish them, just so y'all know, he said you gotta polish them all down and get all that little dirt. A little bit of dirt's what screws them up. But now they've been loose for so long. Ow, that's hot. Had to take him off the hot wrench. But they're, they're so loose so long, it's, 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 you know, ain't much left of them. And I don't have the bolts. So we're going to have to reuse some of these. And the ones we can't reuse, I'll have to put grade eights in it, which I've done on this one. I just put a couple of grade eights in them. But I welded them. And I'll, I'll get some new bolts for them and then put new bolts in it. I'll just hope the weld holds.
even, dirt and all of it. Yeah. That, and that's what's keeping them from tied. That's, yeah. that's what keeps them, you know, like, you, yeah. did you have them try to tighten them out there in the woods? Or yeah, something? they did the other day. Just to get me through, and it didn't last yeah. a day. Yeah, but see, if you, like I said, you got to take them off. you got to get it sanded down. And then you tighten it down with, then it's not coming loose. You see gotcha. what I'm saying? Gotcha. But what about when the bolt gets watered out? I mean, you already got so many strikes against you then, then when the bolt starts working, that's why you got to replace the bolts, you know. Yeah. But if you would have sand, sand this off like this and replaced the bolts, you wouldn't have to tack them. You okay. know, that, that's okay. long story short. But, yep. but what you're doing. years of experience. Uh, that's the next few years of experience. I'm here to tell you. <laughs> I've, lost, I've watched a lot of people go out and just, all yep. pads are loose, you know. Buh, 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 buh. And, we done that big days. Those are one time, uh, and I think we spent months doing it. Probably just, I just said piss on all weld them. Yeah, you, you gotta, you gotta get the dirt off of there. Look how bad it's pitted. They've been there a while. Yeah, but that ain't bad. It, it's this here where it's yeah. been wearing, you know. And then you get that sand in there. It's just like oh yeah. yeah. But. Concerned about there's no safeties bypassed on the crane and it's not turned up any it's all it's IMT just that spec. big of a beast it's that big of a beast even tied to a kenworth even tied to the kenworth that think what that thing do better. on a corn binder <laughs> he get it hooked on the back of the dinda and pick the whole dinda <laughs> be man cave material I think I think your point of view is a bit skewed. We're, I'm get this stuff out. Of so look! Look at all the mess that Dindin made. To start Let's get yeah, the, the man cave broke us okay. up. So since we're getting ready to take Brutus to the new job, I figured I'd check and see if a service was due. And I broke my step off the other day, so I think it's gonna be comical. So you want to see me get in this thing? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, <laughs> see, <laughs> look at that, that's over your waist. Right. Oh, let's see if she got it. Oh get up, mommy. <laughs> you're gonna get, you're gonna get killed. I'm sitting here holding this phone. If you fall, I'll okay. catch you. Oh I got this. God. Okay, yeah. see, Woo. I don't think. <laughs> no I'm in. I told her, boy, Woo. give me five minutes and I'll fix this step. You weren't gonna fix it. All right, I'm gonna get my hose. I'll be back. Okay. Don't Very move. Cool. That's my helper. We put all the boomers up. Trying to get out of the road here. Moving back into. Alright, get up here. 
Want to ride in Brutus? Yep. Soon enough, you'll be driving him in. Ooh. Don't bust your butt. I'll be here to catch if you screw up. Ooh. Brutus does all the shopping at the Long and Tall store, you hear me? You gonna let Daddy sit down? Mm -hmm. You want Daddy sit on the baby? Uh, you ready? What'd you think of that? You gonna go with daddy from now on, move equipment? fall with the rain they got pounded all winter and we're trying to move in we got about three acres on the ground some of it's pretty good wood or four acres probably rather and we need to get that stuff picked up and get cut we got this woods to cut up in here <laughs> the yard was a mess we trucked around like crazy it's just uh but we got to get it finished up because we got wood on the ground going bad Ha, ha, ha.